Bola Tinebu, the architect of modern Lagos and Nigeria political strategies, early life and education. Bola Ahmed Tinebu was born on 29th March 1952 in Lagos, Nigeria. He hailed from a prominent Yoruba family, which has played a significant role in political and social development. Tinebu early education began in Lagos where he attended St. John's Primary School, Haroloya and Children's Home School in Ibadan. He moved to United States for higher education and attended Richard J. Daly College in Chicago, Illinois before transferring to Chicago State University. At Chicago State University, Tinebu excelled academically earning a bachelor degree in accounting in 1979, early career. After completing his education, Tinebu worked in a United States as accountant with various firms, including Arthur Anderson, Deloitte, Hanskin and Sales, and GDT Services Corporation. His professionalism career in the United States provided him with a valuable experience and skill, which he later brought back to Nigeria. Upon returning to Nigeria in the early 1980s, Tinebu joined Mobile Oil Nigeria where he worked as a auditor and eventually becoming a senior executive. His success in the corporate world laid a strong foundation for his entry into politics as it showcased his capability in leadership and management as well as financial oversight. Early entry into politics on it, oh sorry, early entry into politics. Tinebu pol, the political journey began in the late 1980s. He joined Social Democratic Party SDP and was elected the Nigeria Senate in 1993, representing the Lagos West constituency. His tenure as the Senate was short lived due to the military coup that brought General Sani Abashe to power and led to the dissolution of the democratic institution. And in Tinebu became an active member of the pro-democracy movement, advocating for the restoration of democratic governance in Nigeria. He was a prominent member of National Democratic Coalition, ANDECO, a group that opposed military rule and campaigned for the annulment of the June 12, 1993 presidential election. He believed to have been, which believed to have been won by Masoud Abiola. Governor of Lagos State in 1991. Following the end of the military rule and the return to civilian governance, Bola Tinebu ran for and was elected the governor of Lagos State under the platform of the Alliance for Democracy AD. He was re elected for second term in 2003, serving until 2007. Tinebu Chenecha, as a governor, is widely regarded as, as transformative. He implemented numerous reforms aimed at improving governance, infrastructure, and public services in Lagos State. Key achievements of his administration include revenue generation. Tinebu overhauled the state tax collection system, significantly increasing Lagos' internally generated revenue. This financial boost enabled substantial investment in infrastructure and public services. Infrastructure development, number two. His administration focused on developing the road network, public transportation, and urban planning. Projects like Lake AP Expressway and the Bus Rapid Transit BRT system were initiated by the address the, they were initiated to address the state transportation challenges. Number three, education and health. Tinebu investment in the education and health sector, improving facility and services. He established the new schools hospitals, ensuring a better access to quality education and health care for the residents. Number four, public service reform. Tinebu introduced reform to, professional, to professionalize the public service, improve efficiency, and reduce corruption. These measures help create a more effective and transparent administration, political strategies, and national influence. After leaving the office as governor, Tinebu continued to wield a significant influence in Nigerian politics. He played a key role in formation of the All Progressive Congress, 
APC in 2013, a major or major opposition party aimed at challenging the de dominance of the People Democratic Party (PDP). The APC success in the uh, in, in 2015 presidential election, which saw Mohamed Buhari elected as president, was partly attributed to Tinubu's strategic political maneuvers and his ability to unite various factions within the party. Tinubu influence extended beyond Lagos State as he became a kingmaker in Nigeria politics. His support was crucial in the election of several state governors, senators and other political office holders. His network and political acumen earned him a nickname, Jagaban, a title of respect and authority. Presidential aspiration and election. Bola Tinebu, long-standing ambition to become president of Nigeria, culminated in his success campaign in the 2023 presidential election. Running on the platform of APC, Tinebu capitalized on his political experience and extensive network and reputation as a reformer to win the election. His victory marked a significant milestone in his political career and signalized his enduring influence in Nigeria politics. President is sworn in on 29th May 2023 at the age of 71, Tinebu presidential presidency began with a focus on continuing his legacy of reform and development. He, played, he pledged to address critical national issues including economic diversification, security challenges, and infrastructure development. Economic policy, Tinebu administration emphasized on economic reform aimed at boosting industrialization, creating jobs, and reducing poverty. He sought to attract foreign investment, enhance the business environment, and diversify the economy away from its heavy reliance on oil. Security. Tackling Nigeria's security and challenges, particularly the Boko Haram insurgency and bad entry, was a priority for Tinebu. His government worked to strengthen the military, improve the intelligence operation, and address the, the root cause of insecurity, infrastructure, and urban development. Building on the success in Lagos, Tinebu focused on infrastructure projects including roads, railways, and power generation. His administration aimed to improve urban planning and development across Nigeria, education, and healthcare. Continuing to his commitment to social services, services Tinebu presidency sought to enhance educational and healthcare system. He initiated policies to improve access to quality education, healthcare, particularly in rural areas. Legacy and impact. Biola Tinebu legacy is multifaceted. As the governor of Lagos State, he is created accredited and is created and credited with transforming the state into a modern metropolis and a mo model for governance and development in Nigeria. His tenure has laid the groundwork for future administration and set high standards for public services delivery. Nationally, Tinebu role in the formation of APC and its strategic political influence have left an incredible mark on Nigeria's political landscape. His ability to build coalition and navigate complex politics Dynamics has been pivotal in shaping, in shaping contemporary Nigerian politics. As President Tinebu effort to implement reform and address long-standing national challenges will be crucial in defining its legacy. His administration's success is fostering economic growth, improving security, and enhancing public services, which will determine its impact on Nigeria's future. Conclusion Bola Hamed Tinebu journey from a young accountant to prominent political leader and ultimately the president of Nigeria is a testament to his resilience, strategic acumen, and commitment to public service. His contribution to Lagos State and Nigeria political evolutions have cemented his place as a significant figure in the country's history. As he leads Nigeria, the nation watches with hope and anticipation to the, see how his president will shape the future of the Africa's most populous country.
thank you for watching my videos i request to subscribe share so that next time you will get the same informative video like this thank you very much